Today we're going to look at rounding to two decimal places. Before we begin, there's a subscribe button there. Press it so that you can become one of those students who follows me, so that you can also have lots of maths help with your curriculum at school. Right, now, we have here a number, 0 0.236. And we need to round it to two decimal places, which means our answer will only have those two and obviously the unit in the front if there is one with a decimal point. But we will not be having anything standing there. So how are we going to achieve that? Well, we're going to use the same rules we used before. If we are rounding this one, which is the second decimal, because this is the lecture on two decimal places, then we are using this one to decide how that one is going to change. Okay, so we've just moved on to the next column to decide how are we going to change the hundredth column because that's the second decimal place. Now we know that 6 is actually bigger than 5, which means it is going to actually adjust this 3 into a 4. So the answer will then be 0 0.24. Okay, and you can see there's nothing written in this column because it is to two decimal places. Let's look at another example. Okay, we, yeah, we have 1.568. You already know this is the number that's going to decide if it has an impact on changing that one because this is the one we are rounding to. So our answer will only have two decimal places in it. Now let's see, are we going to change the 6? Yes, we are. Why? Because 8 is bigger than 5. Remember, it's 5 and up that changes the digit. And 8 is bigger than 5, so we're going to add 1 on to 6. It's going to be a plus 1 here, which is going to leave us with the answer of 1.57. Okay, got it. Let's look at another one. We have 0 0.322. Okay, and we're rounding to two decimal places. Can the 2 actually affect this 2? No, it can't. Why? Because 2, this 2 here, is smaller than 5, which means when we round to two decimal places for this number, we're only going to write 0 0.32. This remains the same because that couldn't change that. Okay, so our answer to two decimal places here is 0 0.32. Next one and the last one. Okay, so we have 0 0.588. Right, so I would like you to run ahead and try and do this without me. What is your answer going to look like in two decimal places? It's going to be 0 0.59. Because this 8 is bigger than 5, so it changed that one by one digit. It went up to 9. Okay, so once again, if you're not already following me on my lectures, please press subscribe so that you can. Um, and just uh, keep up to date with all your rules for maths which I cover on all the clips on this channel. And we'll see you soon.